down a muddy road, far from the nearest village, an expanse of recently cleared land and a dirty secret. A new Chinese banana plantation takes shape 25 kilometers from the Lao capital, Vientiane. That's despite a 2017 ban on such projects because of chemical pollution. About a dozen Lao laborers and one from China work under the supervision of two Chinese men, preparing seedlings to be planted on 30 hectares of land that has been leased by Lao landowners. Despite the smiles of workers in front of the camera, they live in squalor. One woman laborer from the southern city of Paxé was quitting because of work conditions and fear of pesticides. The workers earn about $7 a day. That's just about the minimum wage in Laos, but they must pay for their own food and drinking water. The nearest village, Ban Ilai Nur, is five kilometers away. More permanent living quarters are being built underneath just about the only tree left standing on the cleared land. Satellite imagery suggests most of the land, located in Nasai Tong district, was cleared in April. But how the plantation by the LS Import Export Trading Company got the green light is murky. A district official says the new plantation is permitted by Vientiane municipality if the use of chemicals is not excessive. He would only speak on condition of anonymity. That contradicts the central government. Deputy Agriculture Minister Bun Kuang Kambun Huang told Radio Free Asia that the 2017 ban remains in force. While central and local government tussle over what the rules are, Lao people are clear on what they think of bananas grown for the Chinese market. Here's a vendor at the evening market in Huisai. The large Cavendish strain of bananas that China wants are not native to Laos, but in much of Laos, particularly the northern border province of Luang Nam Tha, farmers increasingly cater to China. It can provide a ready source of income, but farmers have paid a price. This Akka Hill Tribe woman says her husband urinated blood after working on the plantation next to their house in Singh district and now has cancer. She says the plantation is off limits to her kids. A doctor at Moonsing Hospital confirmed that plantation workers had gotten sick. Mung Sing has only a fraction of the banana plantations it had a few years ago, but in this village, they'll be growing Chinese bananas for another two years at least, until the current contract runs out.